How to troubleshoot fault code 771. Open circuit drive motor wiring on your JLG scissor lift. If your machine is encountering this fault the lift will have no drive. The platform fault light will be flashing 7 7, and a 7 7 1 code will be displayed on the JLG analyzer when the drive function is activated. Some possible causes for this error code are, a faulty drive motor, faulty power module, faulty harness, or corrupt programming. Troubleshooting steps. Step 1. Power on the machine with the key switch turned to the platform position and both emergency stop switches pulled out. Plug in your JLG analyzer and check the logged help for additional help codes. Hit escape two times. Right arrow to system test. Activate test and monitor the results. Check for 24V between the B plus and B terminals on the power module. If the voltage is low, check and repair the batteries, cables, and connections. If 24 volts is present, continue to the next steps. Step 2. Power off the machine and unplug the battery disconnect. Disconnect the drive motor wiring from the power module. The power module is located in the front frame between the drive motors. Put your multimeter in resistance mode and check the following through the drive motor harness. If any of the readings are incorrect, disconnect the wires from the drive motor and test directly at the motor terminals. If all readings are correct, continue to the power module evaluation. Step 3. Hook all of the wires and cables back up to the power module and drive motors. Plug the battery disconnect back in. Step 4. Power the machine back on with the key switch turned to ground mode and the emergency stop pulled out. With the JLG analyzer go to access level 2 and put in the code 33271. Go to machine setup. Right arrow through the settings and record them. Toggle the model and mark it, then push in the emergency stop switch. Power the machine on and repeat the previous steps to get into machine setup. Change back to the settings recorded in the earlier step. Press escape back to the menu and go to calibrations. Calibrate the tilt and elevation sensors. Push in the emergency stop switch to save the settings. 5. Power the machine on and check for help codes. Thanks for watching. If this video helped you, let us know by hitting the like button and subscribing to the channel.